What's going on everybody? Today I have a 2010 Dodge Challenger RT. It's gonna be a full tour of the Challenger. We'll start it up, show the engine, get an exhaust clip, we'll show a bunch of features in the interior as well as exterior. Today I'm at Navarre Motors in Navarre, Florida. Nice enough to let me come down and film the Challenger for you guys today. So, let's go ahead and fire it up. It's an orange exterior with black stripes. With black leather interior. It has keyless ignition. Just keep the key on you. And hit the button to start. Got a full leather wrapped steering wheel. It's a six speed manual. In reverse, just over and up. Let's go ahead and shut it up. Tinted windows, 24,000 miles. Got audio controls on the steering wheel, cruise control, wipers, turn signal stock, automatic lights, dimmer, easy to use climate control, AC, different temperature, different zones, front and rear defrost, circulation, traction control on and off, two stage heated seats for the driver and passenger, full power outlet. Garage home link, sunroof, soft touch materials on the dashboard, soft touch door materials, leather, more leather, carbon fiber trim, automatic windows, one touch, one touch down automatic, both sides. The leather on the steering wheel is really nice. Stitching on the center console, with a power outlet, coin holders, and an iPod player. Holders, nice Mopar ball shift knob, Mopar navigation system, 430. Or, sorry, this is the 730N. This is the 730N. So this one already has tracks downloaded to it. Good sounding sound system. Navigation. Point of interest. In your map. Voice activation. Open and close for your CD. Auxiliary input jack. As well as a USB import. Very good sounding sound system. Easy to use vents. Open and close. Overall, very nice interior. So, I'm gonna turn on the headlights, fog lights, fills the hazards. I'm gonna go and check out the exterior. Runs really good, nice and smooth. It's also got the uh, throwback package on it, includes these wheels, as well as the old school Challenger emblems. Dual exhaust. 
exhaust. Throw back fuel cap. And we'll go ahead and pop the hood. RT comes with the 5.7 liter Hemi V8. Built around 350 horsepower. Go ahead and shut it down. Go ahead and pop the trunk. Check out the rest of the vehicle. Challenger being a sports car actually has a very usable trunk. Good amount of space, it's just kind of a small opening. The other thing that's nice about the Challenger is the back seat. Capabilities. Got power seats as well, as you can see. The back seat of the Challenger is actually very nice for a, especially for a two seater or for a uh, sports car. You have air vents back here, actually. That's a really nice feature, especially for a two-seater. Most, a lot of four-door cars don't even come with those. You also have a fold-down armrest in the rear. Leather stitched. You also have a padded armrest over here as well. Well guys, I hope you enjoyed the full in-depth tour on the 2010 Dodge Challenger RT. Should stay tuned next time as more where that came from. Take care everybody.